breaking news an arrest as Boston police investigate the shooting in Mattapan that happened over the weekend. It claimed the life of a 74 year old woman. Police say the victim, who is a grandmother, was an innocent victim who deserves justice. WBZ's Paul Burton is live in Mattapan tonight. Mm. Paul? Yeah, it's been a long, sad day here in Mattapan. The family, the family of Eleanor Maloney came by a short time ago. It's been the first time they've been able to return home since the shooting. We spoke with Eleanor's brother, who says she was a woman of strong faith who will be greatly missed. Yeah, we're all devastated. It's still a shock to me. Carson Maloney tries to find the words to describe how much his sister meant to him. 74-year-old Eleanor Maloney was shot and killed outside her Mattapan home. Her younger brother can't believe she's gone. Well, I couldn't believe that it was Eleanor because I just spoke to her. This afternoon, police arrested 37-year-old Anthony Davis of Mattapan in connection with this weekend's deadly shooting. Davis is charged with unlawful possession of a firearm. This is his fourth offense. Police say he's an armed career criminal. I know who he is, mm -hmm. and I don't know what's going on. I need to find out what's going on before I can even say anything. Police did not say if Davis is suspected in shooting Maloney. Two other men were also shot but suffered non-life-threatening injuries. Police say Davis has a lengthy criminal past. According to the Suffolk County DA, Davis was charged in 2004 in a murder case but was eventually acquitted. He was also found guilty on gun charges in 2009 and 2013 and sentenced to prison. On Monday, Boston police investigators with canines searched the home. Maloney was a retired nurse. She worked at Boston Medical Center for 44 years as an operating room technician. Carson knows, and police confirm, Eleanor was an innocent bystander who got caught in the crossfire. Well, she was a beautiful person, very beautiful. I don't even think Eleanor had any enemies. She doesn't bother anyone. As a matter of fact, she's always there to help. Police are still investigating the shooting. 37-year-old Anthony Davis remains in the hospital tonight. He'll be arraigned on a later date. Reporting live in Mattapan, I'm Paul Burton, WBZ News.